Professor Kamani had been in his room for less than an hour when the phone rang. He looked at his watch, not seven o'clock yet. He looked out a window, pitch dark already. How fast falls the African night? Like a heavy rain of ink. He, thought, he picked up the phone. Is it Professor Kimani? A male voice on the line asked. Professor Kimani did not respond. Hey, I heard you pick up, so I know you are there. Look. I have an urgent message for you from Agda. It pronounced Agda as a word, Agda. Hello are you still there, Professor Kimani? This time Professor Kamani responded. Agda, the Agency for Government and Development in Africa, had sent him here, to Benjil. Yes, I am here. Good. Agda's message for you is that you accept me as your guide while you are here. Now before you go worrying about that arrangement, let me assure you that I'll do everything I can to make your mission here a success. You have my word. Nigerian. Professor Kamani guessed from the man's tendency to inject anger into every stressed syllable. Educated Nigerian. He added this qualification after taking into account the man's impeccable grammar. Who are you? Letter. Right now, I want to know if you have received a briefcase I left at your hotel for you. Professor Kamani looked at a briefcase briefcase his hotel had just delivered to his room. Yes. I have received it, just now, in fact, I can't open it, though. Did you scramble its lock perhaps? It's one, one, two, four. I'm sorry. What was that? That was its combination lock. Set the lock on that. The briefcase should open. Now, before you do anything foolish, first make sure that it contains all the items that it ought to have. They are listed on sheet that you'll find inside. Oh, Professor Kimani, that was an order. The voice paused, expecting protest from Professor Kimani. When none came, it gave the rest of its demand. Obey, Professor Kimani, obey. Still, Professor Kimani did not protest. Excellent. Applauded the Nigerian, clearly pleased with his quick victory. So, Professor Kimani, how much time will you need to acquaint yourself with the material in your briefly, one hour? He did wait for answer. One hour it is, then. Good night. Wait. Professor Kamani said. Haven't you forgotten, something? Me, forget? Cocky educated Nigerian. Professor Kamani said to himself, now adding up all of his assessment about the man. I asked for your name. Who are you? Oh, that. Let's just say I am your guide. I meant your real name. Professor Kamani insisted. Instead of an answer, he heard the line die suddenly from the other end. Comrade Malusi got a similar call after, Pastor Chiamaka later, engineer to hear the last. All three said they had failed to open their briefcases. To all three the caller gave the key. One, one, two, four.